Ah. I, I like that the um the moment that you just gave in was where my episode ended. Uh, that's okay. that's appropriate. Thing so after this naked naked after this naked. Right. Very nice. After this next episode, it's probably going to be a good place to call it. Yeah, that sounds about right. Let me see. Grab that. Where are those? All right, there's the recipe. So, iron blocks, redstone, where the hell's the glass? I had it a moment ago. It's probably in this one. Yes. All right. So, need to make an iron block or... Between four and eight. I don't know which recipe it's going to ask for. I assume there's like a config file thing that governs this. Yeah. Same, I don't know which one it's going to ask for. All right. I need... All right, so it's not that one, which means it's probably the one that requires diamonds. That's acceptable. Where the fuck did I put them diamonds? There you go. So, yeah. there. Son of a whore. Do we not have it? Yeah, I put the. They're all in. Those are in the right order. Why is it not, not running work? the mod? Because it's where we were. Let me. Uh, if, go into your options, and you can see what mods are running, I think. No by teleporter. Hold on. I want to check something, and then it just rises. this. Teleporter is still there. I'm going to throw away the fucking resources. I know that I'm throwing away diamonds. I'm throwing away diamonds, and I don't even care anymore. Have, uh, have... Eight diamonds. I don't know if that's that's more than any of the recipes called for by a large margin. Have eight iron blocks, sixty-four glass, three ender pearls, and have ten redstone blocks. There, that's a fair trade. I've lost my ability to give a fuck right now. Right, where are those levers? There. All right. Let me change my game back to regular. And uh, all right, now I gotta figure out how I want to do this. So I don't know if shit will die immediately or not. But all right, I need a cobble. Where B cobble is. There we go. Well, you probably got some in the chest, right? Yeah. Alright, so. I want to make this work proper. Properly. Yes, yeah, so if I want to make this work proper, then. Oh, that's slightly full. That's nice to see. So none of your uh, portal recipes worked? Nope, I can only figure that maybe I accidentally deleted the config that made it thing. The I config that made it thing. Can exit only? Good. So, and then I just take this back up. I don't know how this will work, but I'll find out shortly. I can't remember if putting, um, if putting, uh, hoppers under the teleporters worked. Um. I don't think it did, but I think putting them adjacent to the teleporters worked. I'm trying to remember if the teleporters actually teleport drops. Oh, Being I'm that gonna... they are, you know, entities. We're going to find out shortly. I mean, the worst that will happen is you'll just crash the game. Yeah. 
then I guess we'll stop. <laughs> yeah, well. Let's try that. What happens? I'm not putting that here. I didn't set any sort of, uh, I need to go set those, but I'll worry about that in a moment. So, bleh, bleh. I'll find out if this will work. Hopper. Alright, so let me put a... Where's that torch? Oh, in the chest, because there's hoppers all around the ground. <laughs> Seems reasonable. Uh -huh. We'll find out if this works. Alright, uh, I need to set these to... A, I'll set these to potato. Well, we have plenty of that. Yeah. Plenty of potato. All of the potato. Alright. Alright. Back in the game. <laughs> so I can go back up the easy way. Well, actually, let me go down. I'm going to change it back over to uh, normal mode. Now, if this isn't going to work at all, we should end up with monsters... I'll find out if this works. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Well, I'm just waiting. It's a long. Yeah, it takes a minute. The startup cycle. Yes, but that's true on any spawner. It's like booting a 386. I mean, we had a 486, and even that wasn't that fast. Okay, that works. I don't know how that worked, but that worked. Look, sometimes it's important to just not ask questions. Yeah, I'm going to sit here and watch monsters fall for a while. I'm doing the opposite. Watching monsters fly? Well, rise, yes. Ah. Because I don't, water? I don't have the fall system in place yet. Ah. My fall engine has not been installed. It's coming in this spring. <laughs> Bring fall in this spring. And the game crashed. Yeah, I noticed. I think you're dropping stuff on the teleporter too fast. Uh, that could very well be the case. Well, I think that's going to be it for us tonight, then. Yeah, I'll probably try and edit this onto the back of that. Uh, and I just want to check to make sure that everything... Well, I guess I should start back up and put it in peaceful quickly. And remove those teleporters. If you can. So, well, thankfully, if I start it back up in single player... I cannot do it that way. Well, uh... I think hmm. last time, uh, you know, in the last world we were using these, you had to go into uh, MC Edit and remove the teleporter blocks. Yeah, I think you're right. Let me see something. Yeah, because the problem was mobs... Were hitting it too quickly. Yeah. It was It was overloading the buffer or something. So yes, maybe you can't use teleporters for this at the rate yours is working. Let's see. Yep, it crashes every single time. All right. Yeah, yeah, all right. Well, I suppose that is... Uh, That's going to be the end of this for tonight. Yeah, as I f try and remember how to MC edit that. <laughs> Oops. So I'll probably try and remember to edit this on to the end of another video. Meanwhile, I'm just going to have a nine-minute episode. Yeah. Yeah. I may just do that too. Well, I have learned something very important from this, which is those teleporters have uh, limits. And I don't know if it's even that my spawner was working very fast so much as it's not designed for that. So I'll redesign that probably over the interim. Interim. Because I could just really, if I wanted to build a flume that took all the mobs somewhere else. I mean, you mean like did... a traditional mob spawner? 
Yeah, we did uh, say that it was kind of okay if we wanted to build an outlet that took it outside of the spawn area. So, did we? I thought we did. Uh. Eh. I mean, if you just take it up high enough, it'll work too. Yeah. Actually, that's. Well, the main thing is I want it to be within a radius so that the mobs, or all of the chambers I built, will continue functioning. Anyway, I'll end this episode here. There we go. Well, that certainly was eventful. Uh, it was full of fun. events. Damn, I was trying to end at a good point, but my uh, hotkeys stopped responding. Whoops. Whoops. So I'm ending here.